Hey folks, Kevin here. Well, it is uh, December 14th, 2023, and uh, since uh, winter's gotten here and I've gotten some of the equipment in the workshop, I've been spending a lot of time working on articles, uh, book stuff, all sorts of things around here. But I posted a couple of articles, one on vernal pools and that sort of thing. So in order to get to the website, it's at mindfullivingsanctuary.com. That's mindfullivingsanctuary, without any underscores at all, dot com. And you get to the website. So here's the website here. Uh, I don't know that I'll do much with uh, newsletters at all. I did one uh, last, <coughs> last spring. But you go to the home screen, there's a drawing I did incorporating all aspects of, of life uh, didn't work out so well on this uh, website. There's an about page uh, and it's all about growing a better tomorrow. Uh, Thea and I, what we look like, our contact information. Uh, you can see we, we have the nursery here, we have a YouTube channel, the Bonanza store, eBay store, we have Facebook. I really don't do too much with those things, but we do use the eBay store and the Bonanza store, and that's for selling our used books and all. Um, you can reach out to us by filling out the contact form. I'm up at the top of the page. But the, what I wanted to show you today was the article section here. Uh, so these are articles. I these were articles I posted last season. So a little bit about hula culture, water harvesting, ways to build soil. What else we got? Food force, permaculture zones, introduction and examples, permaculture design, permaculture principles, permaculture ethics, introduction to permaculture, and I guess I made a first article as well. And just recently, as I'm zooming down here, I apologize for this, uh, I posted... Um, an article on vernal pools. Uh, so you just click the read me below it here and you'll see the article on vernal pools. Those are the uh, those transient uh, wet <coughs> uh, wet uh, areas uh, in the forested area where this is very important for salamanders and frogs to reproduce. Uh, not a big spot for mosquitoes but then I went ahead and wrote uh, a mosquito control, natural mosquito control. So I have an article on that. I also did a quick article on glyphosate and Roundup, uh, a well-known herbicide used both uh, agriculturally, industrially, and by homeowners as well. So it's, uh, and I really didn't. I really emphasize another person's article at Consumer. Uh, it's a Consumer Resources. It's it's listed in that article. But yesterday I went ahead and posted uh, this video, uh, this uh, article, Holistic Investment Strategies for Mindful Living. And it goes over the 10 categories that I talk about for investing. It's not just financial investing, material investments, living investments, intellectual investments, exper experiential investments, uh, social, cultural, spiritual, physical, mental, and emotional uh, forms of capital, things that we can invest in to improve our quality of life. Uh, later on today, I'll be uh, posting another article as well, uh, and I'll go over that hopefully uh, in a future video. But I just wanted to make sure that you're aware of, uh, I'm going to try and get more active. Uh, during the summertime, I just couldn't uh, get things done. Once growing season and earthwork season gets started here, I just can't keep up with uh, doing work on the um, on the website. So any feedback on these, there's places for comments at the bottom of the articles, things that you think should be added. Uh, these are um, these are all subject to changes as my awareness and knowledge, uh, as I continue to invest in myself, I learn new things all the time. And so uh, nothing's in concrete or, or ironclad. Uh, they're all constantly evolving as new information comes, comes about. And, uh, and maybe today or tomorrow, I'm still working on a couple things. It's, it's another article, grow, you know, how to grow a better tomorrow. Uh, and I cover a whole bunch of different aspects. 
and uh, and it's and it all stems from uh, my personal goal of always trying to create a better version of myself each and every day, realizing my faults, my shortcomings, uh, my strengths, my weaknesses, and so on. And that's always ev evolving. And I'm just trying with this media with YouTube uh, sharing things that I'm doing around here and explaining the reasons why, but I thought more detail in the website articles may help people to understand where is this guy coming from, what are his thought processes, and a lot of what I do, I used to do things in mind maps, and that's really how my mind works. Uh, I do things in like bullet statements in my mind, and so you'll see some of the articles are very much laid out like that. Uh, I've toyed with the idea of someday writing a book about the various topics, and I probably won't ever do that. I just don't have t enough time for that. And books aren't my thing, although we're book resellers. Uh, a dyslexic uh, who hates to read, uh, you know, who is uh, gaining a great deal of respect for, for books as each year goes on throughout my life. So... Uh, so that's it for today's video. I just thought I'd share these thoughts with you and let you know we do have MindfulLivingSanctuary.com. That's always in the bottom of the videos. You can click on uh, the website. You can click on the eBay store, those things as well, to see the sorts of books that we're selling as well. So I think that wraps things up. Stay safe. Take good care of yourselves. And by all means, folks, always be working on yourself and working on your environment. Uh, and more to come. Take care now. Bye-bye.